Yeah, I'm gonna show some of my cool, some of the cool ways I like actually displaying data in SQLite. So, as you can see, we have uh, table two, and when I select all the elements and print them out, that's what it looks like. You can change the separator if you want to like a comma or whatever, and then if you want to output that or whatever to a file, you can load that as a CSV. Uh, there is an actual way to load it directly to a CSV besides that, but that's the only way I'm thinking of right now. Uh, besides the separator, there's a lot cooler stuff you can do. You can change the mode. One of my favorite modes is column mode. So if you set the mode into column, and then we print the data off. Uh, it looks kind of cool, but what makes it better is when you add headers on there. So let's specify headers is on. As you can see, now it shows a little partition deal right there, so you can separate the two. And you have you have your headers, and then you actually have your individual records down here. And that's a nice way to format it. You can also specify your width. So if you want to specify your width, you can make it all four if you want. As you can see, this is length four, length four, length four. If you want like the middle one to be longer or something, you can change it to six or whatever you need to do. And there you go. That, that's one really cool way to print off data. Another cool thing you can do is you can actually print off directly into HTML. So to do that, you can specify mode and then setting equal to HTML. If you want to show what mode you can, what you're in, you can do a dot show. It'll show your echo, explain, blah, 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 mode right there. This is HTML. And also show where your output is and also your separator. We mess with output. Well, we're going to mess with output in this one and change that to a file name so we can actually use this HTML. But let's see what the HTML is going to print off in the standard out. So as you can see, it'll print all this off. It will even include those header tags. That's because we still have uh, headers is on, whatever headers is. You can specify that it's off. It's off by default. I personally want those on. So let's output this to a file. So let's output file.html sounds like a good name <laughs> all right now let's run the command it just output that to our file let's exit sqlite let's look into our file which is file.html as you can see it print off perfectly except it doesn't have the table so if you actually want to load this into a browser you have to add the table tags Now that we did that, let's load it up. HTML and minimize that for you. There you go. We have D1, D1, T2, just like those headers were specified, and it prints it all out for us, which is pretty cool. I think that was a good basic demo of how you can actually display data, and I hope you guys enjoyed. Peace.